Vitality of the Ox, get excited and invigorate, gain a Lee Sin. When you field him, your team gains 20% attack speed, doubled for 3 seconds after Lee Sin shields them. Gain a Fiora, oof. I feel like re-rolling this one, guys. I'm gonna re-roll. Burning Spirit is crazy, no? Oh, Predatory. Predatory Yumi. Oh, let's go, Yumi carry. Frick it. Let's try. Let's try Yumi carry. <sighs> I had Zoe, so I was like, eh, but I have Zoe, man. Zoe's pretty good. But let's try Yumi carry. Uh, so I need some hard units. So basically what Yumi does now is she always crits. Always crits with her ability. Which is pretty based. I think I'm gonna level here. Just to have a better just to have better odds on the next shop refresh here. Maybe we can get two Yumi's. <laughs> Who knows? Surely. Um I get heart, but heart isn't that good enough. I get admin. Let's check what admin is. At 40% health, admins gain 75% ability power. On ally death, admins gain 30 mana. On ability cast, admins gain 20% attack speed. Doesn't really matter. I can just press a random one. I am not playing this. That's for sure. I'm just gonna keep playing this then. Not a, not a good build up board though, guys. Not the best board here that I've ever seen. Let's buy this Star Guardian. Let's put to the left the people that we can sell. We want Star Guardian. We want Star Guardian ASAP. Star Guardian. Blue buff Yumi is insane with Star Guardian, of course. Because it not only lowers her max mana to 50, but also when she gets a takedown. Which most of the time she will, right? Because I'm going full damage Yumi here. Uh, with predatory precision, she already gains 30 ability power, 75% critical strike chance, which basically makes it 100. Remember, every champion has 25% base critical strike chance, and her ability can critically strike, yeah. So, basically, she just always, always crits. Spell Slinger. I'm kind of just down to level here, man. Let's just level here, man. Because I don't want to not play the two-star, right? Okay, okay, interesting, interesting. We have Spell Slinger as well now. This Yumi is very interesting. I'm going to sell this Lux if I win. I'm not actually going to play Lux. Also, I should be playing supers, right, as well. You have to play Yumi with supers, no? But do I? I don't have to. You want to, but I don't have to. And I feel like a lot of people will play supers. Siphoning wins. Yeah, he has Omnivamp, so he's gonna play supers Yasuo. Yeah, yeah, you know what? No supers, guys. No supers. Let the other people play supers. There is a lot of people that will try to play supers, I feel like. I mean, even just that one Yasuo is already gonna poop on my parade. Because he kind of has to play supers. Yasuo really likes to play supers if you play 3-star Yasuo. But Yumi likes it, but, you know, it doesn't have to be. Doesn't have to be. Okay, so this Yumi is trash. We don't need crit on her. We already always crit. We want Rabadons. Honestly, double Rabadons. But we'll go Rabadons, Giant Slayer. Stuff like that. That's what we want. That is what we want, guys. Maybe I should play two Yumi's. <laughs> I lose Spell Slinger, which doesn't do that much, though. How much damage is Lulu doing? Nah, I think it's worth. I think it's worth to play two Yumi's. Actually, it's probably not. Because without blue buff, she wouldn't do that much. 
I'm not sure, guys. I'm not sure. We get a Star Guardian. Guys, what, what do you think? What is this, uh... What is, uh, what is this comp gonna be? Shurko top 3 under EU vest. Holy Shurko Giga. Thank you, man. For real, man is OP. Thank you, thank you. He's built D4. I don't know about that. But thank you, guys. Guys, what should we play? I mean, I'm just asking you guys. You know, you guys are playing. You guys are the chats. You guys are top 3 under EU vest, not me. Um... What are we trying to do here? We're trying to run a bunch of juicy, juicy Star Guardians. Do you think I can win here by leveling, playing the second Yumi? Probably not. I already fought him. Okay, we're positioning around Talon. This is the Talon guy. Watch this. He's gonna jump on her. She's the furthest in the corner. I, I think we win. Next retribution. Holy, that's a position diff, guys. That is a position diff. Nice. He jumped away from the kitty cat. Not too bad. <sighs> okay. Not sure exactly what I'm looking for. I'm looking for five... Star Guardian, probably. So, Echo. Am I dull, man? Five is rough. But honestly, Talia is not bad. I mean, let's just see, man. Maybe I'll just get lucky and the other guy will get unlucky. And he will not get any... Um, what's, the, what's their face? He will not get any of these. Oh, this is not a good item. These are not good items. We don't want Jewel Gauntlet. She always crits. Jewel Gauntlet is wasted. Um, and maybe he won't find any of the supers, and I'll just find all of them. You know, maybe he's just gonna be super lucky. Who knows? Probably not. <laughs> Probably not, I'll keep it a stack. But who knows? I don't think we ever need this. Is there a Star Guardian Brawler? No. For our Aegis choices, we definitely play um, Alistair for Mascot with this beautiful little kitty cat. And, um, yeah, the Echo, which is a Star Guardian. Catch my drift. I'm gonna do this. And then the crit, I don't know what to do with the crit. I don't think we go for, for, um, heart. I don't think we do that. Maybe if I get a heart emblem, what happens then? Yumi is so good. I can't believe Yumi is good enough to just single-handedly hard carry here. Getting getting the Sona was definitely lucky though. So let's just keep that in mind. The Sona is, I think, doing a lot of the heavy lifting. If we check out the healing number. Oh, wait, never mind. Oh. I mean, it's a tome for sure. I'm pretty sure I just popped them right now. I have Star Guardian here, so I can get Star Guardian out of it. Okay, fair enough. Can we get double Star Guardian? Oh, Aegis Emblem, Aegis Ox Force. I think it's Aegis. The prankster, prankster, prankster. Prankster is pretty good, but then I have no damage. I think it's an Aegis emblem. I do think it's some Aegis action. Aegis is very stupidly strong. I think she's gonna be the Aegis for the most part. She's the only other frontline that I can think of. 
that would require or that would be Aegis. Wow, this guy is so strong. <laughs> but honestly, it's fine. We already had a good streak with the win streak, man. This is fine. Level 5. Okay. Nice. I think this is gonna be a good game. We also found the Rel, which is huge. Very big. I definitely don't play these guys now, the supers. I definitely don't play supers now. I'm gonna play her. I'm gonna play this. I'm gonna play probably not a Star Guardian any. Star Guardian any does sound pretty insane. Star Guardian Alistair. Star Guardian any. Bramble Best Aegis. <clears throat> Oh, but she's mana locked. She's mana locked during the shield being up. Ah, it's still good though. Still kind of good, no? Oh, shield again. Oh, come on. Ah, close. Close. Close, close. Nice. So what are we doing here? We're just gonna reroll Yumi. The moment we hit two star Yumi, we should be pretty strong. Uh, this is good. No, I'm still second last pick. I almost was second pick. Okay. Let's see if we can get the items. Oh, oh, promising, promising. Second last pick though, a little bit unfortunate. The other guy didn't lose. Mm. Mm -hmm -hmm -hmm. Both rods gone, rip. Gonna just go for the Sunfire, I assume. Let's go for a Sunfire then. That is not too good. Yo, Mr. Hollow Sloth. Thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Much appreciated, man. Thank you for your support. Thank you, thank you. Welcome to Shuriken, everybody. Really appreciate it, my guy. Really do. Let me put this. Oh, yeah. I think we're just rolling, huh? Let's just get to rolling. This is useless, by the way. This can be easily kicked. This can be easily kicked. For a defender or what? Yeah, this thing is useless. Because we already have a... Heart. We already have heart. From Sona. And she's giving us Spell Slinger. So this is kicked. Oh, can you can you can you do your last deed and get the 1v1? No, you can't. You piece of garbage. Archangel is good on Yumi no. No. I want the upfront damage. I don't want the Archangels. I feel like Archangel is not that good this set. Oftentimes you want the upfront damage. Oh <gasps> holy huge. Oh. Okay, my, my front line is infinite now. My front line is absolutely infinite. Wowzers, guys. I am so strong. I'd actually rather play Gunblade if it's crit Yumi augment. True, Gunblade is great too. Gunblade is great too. For sure. How did I just get one shot in the backline? Does he have hacker? Oh, he's sending it to the backline. What a chat. Yeah, he has hacker with this. What a giga chat, man. Gets the thing fast, gets the three star. He's gonna win. What a what a good player, holy. How come no jewel gauntlet? Just trying to learn. This augment makes her always crit, so you do not want the jewel gauntlet. Kimil three, yeah.
Do I even need Nila? I do need Nila, right? I do need Nila. I'm gonna sell Vi if I win. Eh, if I win, if I don't drop money. If I win, I sure hope I'll win against these guys. Oh, frick. Oh, frick, man. Huh? <gasps> right, come on, do it, do it, baby. Oh, my. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do, bro. <gasps> I am going Gunblade now. Just want to save HP. Gonna go this and Hodge. Not on her. Hodge on somebody else. Holy Giga Chad. Four star Guardian. What in the living frick? Oh, we definitely need Rabadons now. Rabadons is so important, guys. You want super high AP. Yo, buddy, can you sell your Yubi, please, man? No need, man. Look at this. You have a dragon. Oh, that big dragon of yours, man. Oh, man. The ladies love your big dragon, let me tell you, man. They don't love that stupid little kitty cat. They have a kitty cat themselves, my guy. Oh, boy. Let me tell you, man. Just sell it. Come on, boy. Come on, boy. Give me that easy. kitty. Oh my! What the freak is happening? I'm just high rolling out of my mind. What is this? Oh, six star guardian. No, no, no. Guys, I don't understand, man. I'm literally hacking. Quiet, literally cheating. Quiet, literally, guys. Literally hacked the video game. It is what it is. Do not pick up this Yumi. The moment you pick up this Yumi, she's out of the pool. But as long as you don't pick her up, you have a guaranteed Yumi orb on the ground. But you still have a very high chance of finding more Yumis in the shop. Again, it's just a small little thing. It's a very small little percentage change. But it's always worth, because what's the hardest Yumi to find? The ninth one. And if the ninth one is hit this one, guaranteed, well, you only have to find eight. Very simple. Very simple, guys. Loki, same luck as my last game. Bro, this is disgusting. If you want Yumi, Sona 3 better roll when level 7, no? I'm not sure why you're assuming I want Sona 3. I do not want Sona 3. Suna is just sitting there. Suna is just there. She's actually gonna be kicked. Because the moment I find Syndra, I'm kicking Suna. The moment I put Talia and Syndra, I kick Suna. Because th they give me Spell Slinger and Heart. I'll make this look easy. Okay, just we need to hit Yumi 3. If we hit Yumi 3, we're chilling. We just need to hit Yumi 3. And then we need some more tank items and we're good. Then a Talia, Talia Syndra. Yumi 3, go fast 9. GG. That's it. Level 9, Syndra. Load up your 9, 9 Star Guardian, of course. I'm gonna go 9 Star Guardian here very easily. Super easy 9 Star Guardian. She needs Rabadons, man, so badly, I'm telling you. Oh my god, this, 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 this Annie is, if I hit 3 star Annie, like, I'll definitely keep rolling for 3 star Annie. It's too good. I don't even have my reroll thing yet, and I'm winning some fights. But I feel like it's gonna be too hard. I could go Archangel. I might go Archangel, but I don't want to go Archangel. Yeah. You know what? It's a Chalice. Chalice is great. Chalice is amazing here. Who's the Hodge for? Nobody. Nobody. It's a beautiful Chalice. Oh, frick!
Guys, we have five Yumis. Am I really hacking? Oh. Yes, I am. Well, let me order these. These boys and girls a little bit. This is cell. This is a cell. I, I, I won't fit a Vi anyway late game. I will never have room for Vi. I have no damage against this Yasuo. This Yasuo is a Giga Chad build as well. Double Archangel when he has 66% lifesteal. Such a Chad build, man. Really can't complain. He's never gonna die. This is this is healing through Sunfire as well. But honestly, good loss. Good loss. Two unit loss against three star Yasuo. I think I'm pretty happy with that. Why are so many people playing Yumi, by the way? Everyone's playing Yumi for some reason. Like, I see so many Yumis everywhere. This guy's going for 3-star Yumi, and he's playing Yasuo. I might not be able to hit 3-star Yumi. Maybe I should just level. Okay, never mind. One more, guys. One more. Oh, nice. Any 3. Alright, let's just chill. Let's just chill. One more Yumi. A again, one is on the floor. Don't forget. One more Yumi. Any three is insane, bro. With these emblems. <laughs> oh boy. Nine star guardian. That is gonna be filthy. Oh, is this a Yumi guy? Yes! Yumi back in the pool. I'm rolling instantly. Because the Yasuo guy might roll as well. I roll instantly here. Because I'm gonna kill this guy, right? Unless the Aurelian does some funky stuff. Which I'm hoping it won't. Come on, Aurelian. Just take the L. Thank you, sir. Okay, Yumi back in the pool. A couple Yumi's back. I'm gonna roll here, actually. Oh, big. Come on, Yumi, man. Don't be a smelly little stupid cat. Frick, man. Okay. You have to wait now. That is not good. I'm gonna sell this guy. I have everything ready. Um, please, Yumi. Nice. There's the Yumi boy. Let's get the thumbnail real quick. Alright, okay, that was good though. That was lucky because that... I mean, the Yasuo, it just makes sense for him to go Yumi. But it's just unlucky for me that he is in a position where he can do that. Okay, so what are we doing over here? Popping this. I think I go Jeweled Gauntlet here. Jeweled Gauntlet on Nina. N uh, I go uh, the thing. Thieves Love on Nila. This guy is so strong. Oh wow, one shot. Oh wow. Okay, it's fine. It's fine, don't worry. We're still fine. We level up. Seven star guardian. Okay. Belt on him. Great, great. No hooks, no nothing. Okay, I think we're fine now. We got so much stronger right now. Unlucky that we still couldn't get an item on her. I refuse to put Jewel Gauntlet, it is so bad. The rod is this, almost the same as Jewel Gauntlet. Just a rod is almost the same as a full Jewel Gauntlet for this Yumi right now. That is just not worth. I'll definitely greed for the late game item and try to go first because I, I got such good augments and stuff. I got so lucky this game. 
I'm definitely in a position to go first. So uh, I'll try to get a uh, carousel item and then, yeah, go first with it. And then we just... Not, right now we're just trying to go level 9. To play a uh, full star... We can play 9 star guardian at level 8, I forgot. Yeah, yeah, we're playing 9 star guardian at level 8. And at level 9 we just put another Aegis. We, we put the Leona. Put the Leona. And that's it. This guy is so strong, man, but he played it so well. Like, what a chat. Takes things fast, hits 3-star. It's not easy. New set. It's not easy, man. The rolldowns are hard in the new set. But I, I don't think this guy will ever die to me. So maybe I just get third this game. It could be a third. Unless we kill the Yasuo, like, super quickly here. The thing is, he's gonna get walled by the Annie. Oh, but this is... This is very lucky, guys. The Dragon Claw is very lame. That makes me mad. Because I would win here without Dragon Claw. And now I'm super low. Giga Chat! Never mind. We're chilling. Deserved. Because without Dragon Claw, I win instantly. No Yumi items. No Yumi items, guys. I can't believe Ionic Spark is still up. Very right, nice. Ionic Spark is great here, guys. It's even better than a Chalice. But honestly, if I get, like... I have one and a, uh, two and a half items. The Chalice is doing a lot, so... It's not that bad. And then this is insane. This is really insane. <clears throat> is that crazy, bro? He's gonna move, for sure. I'm gonna keep it. Yeah, he moved. Of course I'm against him. Every time against him. As soon as we can go up against him, we're up against him. It is what it is. Oh wow, the, 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 the hacker thing didn't work. It still walks up to me, though. Nice, we still win. Nice. Lucky, lucky, lucky. I should've repositioned. I wasn't sure if he's gonna reposition. Because the thing is, he has multiple enemies that he can go up against. I don't think we ever need this. We'll never need this anymore. Maybe at level 8, but no, no, no. I'm, I'm, pl I'm playing full Star Guardian at level 8. 9 Star Guardian is such a huge... It's a chase trait. It's literally like twice as effective almost. So all I gotta do is hit... Um, Talia. Talia Syndra are the best. Instead of this, at level 8. If I don't hit, it's fine, though. If I don't hit, it's fine. Oh, he moved the hacker thing. Oh, it's a 1-star. Zed, I think I'm fine. He's just gonna feed me mana. Come on, guys. Kill the Zed. Yumi, come on. Hit Zed once. Nice. Job. That's all we need. Two item Yumi, man. Still really strong. If I drop a Rabadons from this, we're chilling. If we drop an Archangel, we're okay. If we drop a Giant Slayer, we're chilling. Any of these are fine. Level 8, we need to find Talia and we're good. I'm gonna level after this. I'm gonna level after this for sure. I find Talia. I probably won't find Syndra, so I won't have Heart. But Heart is not going to make that much of a difference, right? It's not going to be that important. Definitely would be nice to have the Syndra, though, for Heart. But yeah, Talia and Kaisa is enough to have nine juicers. And Talia is... I right, please don't. Don't more dog me. 15 AP. Well, well, well. Probably Shojin. I 
I should have picked up the the girl right there. I should have picked up the the Lux. I didn't pick up Lux. It's gonna be a Shojin on Talia. She's she's not a like it's not like Talia is useless here just because I have the hero augment for for a Yumi. Talia is still really strong. I got lucky here because I didn't position at all, and he just. I mean, I'm playing against his ghost. I guess it's fine anyway. I, the, guys, the Annie is doing so much heavy lifting, like truly so much heavy lifting. Oh, there's a Lux. Am I really just gonna play Lux instead? I'm probably not going level nine anyway, right? Holy frick, bro. All right, let's go. Okay, nine Star Guardian is still worth, but holy, what is this? Where's the, where are the guys? Where are the people, man? He has a three star Yumi as well. This is the Yasuo guy. But I think nine uh, juicers is just too much. Look at this. I'm getting half my mana full. <laughs> if she gets a kill, I'm pretty sure she just ults again, yeah. Whenever she gets a kill, she gets pretty much full mana again. Yeah, this is ridiculous. I mean, this is... We're generating 200% mana. 200% increased mana. I would love to play her somehow. I could by ditching these, but I'm, I'm definitely not gonna ditch. I mean, the whole lobby is... Wait, they're not. This guy is physical. Nice. I was looking at him because I want to outplay him. I don't care about this guy. I win against this guy anyway. Even if the Zed would attack me, but he shifted Zed anyway. But I was trying to outplay this guy because if I beat his ghost, the game is over. If I beat his ghost here, the game is over. And I win against this guy anyway. This guy's too weak. And here I beat this guy's ghost and we're chilling. Game is over. Yeah. GG. Goodbye. This guy's not dead. No, he is dead. Nice. GG. Well played, guys. We'll take it. That was such a lucky game. That was my luckiest game of this set so far in ranked. For sure. I got a tome. I got a free tome. <laughs> I have platinum four. <laughs> Bro, I got a free tome. Guys, I think like 200 people are platinum right now on the U-Vest. So we'll take it, guys. We'll take it. Basically challenger, right? Kappa. Basically, guys, we already got our goal of reaching Challenger, right? <laughs> Surely it counts. But yeah, th this was, guys, this was just ridiculous luck. I mean, every single tome was perfect as well. Aegis is insane. We'll take it. Subscribe, ring notification bell if you enjoy these TFT videos. Also, make sure to leave an algorithmic comment and an algorithmic like down below to support this video in the YouTube algorithm so I can get some more views. And I'll see you next time.